Hey guys, Alex here. Today's video, I'm gonna do a quick one on why keeping yourself busy is so much better than meditation. So, a lot of people out there say that meditating is great to achieve that complete relaxation and essentially make yourself feel really relaxed and feel like you're on top of the world. That's nothing worrying you, nothing is problematic, everything is cool, everything is calm, everything is going great. Now, I tend to disagree with meditation because I think, personally, when I'm busy, whether it's working on my own website or building up my two channels or even helping out my parents or my friends doing some kind of physical tasks, I think it's a lot better for me mentally as opposed to sitting there in a complete quiet place and just sort of with my eyes closed. I think keeping yourself better is a lot more productive, it's a lot better for my mind, mentally, spiritually. It's just I feel great when I woke up early in the morning, say like 7am, got up, had my breakfast, got down and did some, you know, three or four hours of work for myself, then I went out and did some painting for a couple of hours, helped my parents mow the lawn or whatever, and then I came back and I can look on the day and say, hey, I've done this, I've done that, it's been a great positive day. If I was sitting for the, for the last three hours or four hours doing nothing and sort of with my eyes closed meditating, then that's a completely failure of a day. That's a complete fail. I've done nothing today, nothing's been achieved, nothing's been progressed, I didn't earn any money, that's it. I mean, look, it's, it's fine to sort of have those 30 minutes of quietness when you're in nature, on a beautiful beach, in some kind of tranquil mountain where, where you're overlooking the, the lake or the river, you just have that 30 minutes of quietness to yourself. But as far as on a daily basis goes, I reckon you should keep yourself busy because when you keep yourself busy, you don't give your brain to have those self-defeating and self-doubt creeping up. You know, that freaking voice that tells you to sabotage your own success, that voice that tells you, hey man, we're not gonna be able to, to achieve that. Oh, what if I fail? Oh, oh, what if it doesn't happen? Like, I remember I just recently painted my house in Melbourne last few, few months ago and I remember looking at that place and thinking how the hell Miggy how the hell are you gonna get this thing painted there's so many rooms and there's so much work to do and all the ceilings how are you gonna do it so my eyes were scared but my hands were busy and that's what ultimately got the job done I just didn't care about it I picked up the brush picked up the paint and all the other gear that you need to paint with and I just got busy. I dedicated at least three to four hours every day because I was also working full time and also working on my websites and my channels. So, but I was committed. And eventually, within a couple of months, I got the whole job done. I could have done it in probably a couple of weeks if I wasn't working full time, but hey, eventually the, got, the job got done. So that's my message here, guys. Instead of sitting there and worrying about things, get busy and get shit done. Check out drivenanddesire.com, check out coca-teaexpress.com for natural energy and fat burning and yeah, get out there guys.